Connor. Good luck in your fight on Saturday night. Um, do it all your best. Thank After you. that, if you want to get a proper fight, good to see you. Viva. Okay. <laughs> Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao calls out Conor McGregor. Didn't Pacquiao say that the Mayweather-McGregor fight was a disgrace to boxing? Now Pacquiao wants McGregor also? I realize that Pacquiao was a legend in the sport and he has fought anyone and everyone, but boxing has to move on. What are Manny's plans? Is he going to hold back progress and hold the belt hostage? Or does he really want to do work in boxing and unify his belt with another belt? Errol Spence just got slammed on his head by his Ferrari, so we don't truly know when he'll be back. And if he does come back, he'll probably take a soft touch, which I wouldn't blame him for. Terence Crawford doesn't have a fight lined up. Manny Pacquiao doesn't have a fight lined up. So why isn't this fight being made? Now, if the Pacquiao versus McGregor fight actually happens, I'm not going to be like one of these pure boxing snobs out here and shit all over the fight because I'd watch it and I'd be entertained by it just like I was with the Floyd McGregor fight. But Manny Pacquiao is only fighting once a year so if the McGregor fight happens that will be one more year where the big unification bouts in this weight class aren't happening. Speaking of Bud Crawford though, there is one man that does want to fight him. Now this is a young fighter that is hungry and wants to prove himself and wants to do work in boxing. 147, it's not too far from 140. Obviously you need a big payday, but is it something that's personal between you and Bud Crawford? Not really. I mean, people, you know what? Like, I think the, the online people, you know, they, they think that and, and, and mm. maybe the media, they might think that stuff, but it's, it's not. You know, me and Bud actually cool. Every time we see each other, we cool. We dap each other up. You know, we talk and stuff like that. Be cool. But of course, you know, we competitors. I want to, you know, I definitely will want to fight him. I feel like Bud is one of the best in the, in the, in the right. world. And I want to prove that, you know, I'm one of the best in the world. Right. And, you know, and I was at the top of the one. I was at, you know, at one time he was the king of 140. And, you know, and I was at the same time. I was, you know, I was at the top of 140. And I still feel like I'm at the top of 140. But, you right. know, um, some people could dispute that now. But right. um, so that's why, you know, I, you know, I always just want to fight Crawford. And I feel like, you know, it, it'll be a, a great fight. And I, I feel like he hasn't been. He hasn't been tested by like somebody like me, like what I can bring to the table, like all my attributes and stuff. I feel like I can, you know, I I can actually give him, you know, just a be way better competition than, than he's actually fought before. Regis Pro Gray, he already competed in the World Boxing Super Series, putting his reputation on the line, putting his career on the line. In my opinion, I think Pro Gray is serious and he's one of the top guys is going to be the future of boxing. I think it's time for Manny Pacquiao to pass the torch to one of these new guys or at least step aside and make room. Put your comments down below on this. What do you think about it? And don't forget, hit the damn like button. Subscribe. 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 Subscribe.